Hey y'all, welcome back to the kitchen. So I am actually on my lunch break right now and I'm getting ready to just make my lunch. Uh, I'm getting ready to also upload my uh, video from last night's dinner. OMG, it was delicious y'all. So what I'm doing right now is I have some leftovers. I made butternut squash last night. I did a barbecue jackfruit um, butternut squash. But what I like to do when I make stuff like that, I like to have it the next day in a wrap. So I'm just briefly showing y'all what I'm doing for lunch. <laughs> it's just one of those kind of days. Uh, we had the holiday yesterday, so it's back to business and we are busy. So what I'm doing is I'm taking a little bit of follow your heart. It's my vegan mayo. Okay, I do have my leftover butternut squash that I heated up. I'm gonna grab this. It is super duper delicious, y'all. I did make it a little spicy. So um, when you see the recipe, the, the jerk seasoning that I put on there, you might want to taper it back a little bit because it was extra spicy. <laughs> um, but with all these delicious veggies that are cool, that are going on here, it'll help cool it down some. Okay, so I have some avocado. I got some red onion and tomato. I'm gonna go ahead and just put that right on in there. This is gonna be a pretty thick wrap, but once you see me wrap it up, um, it'll make sense in a minute. What I am going to do is take it off this plate and put it onto my other cutting board. So it'll be easier for me to wrap it up. Okay. It is very full. Um, this is going to be a nice, nice, nice wrap, y'all. Let me get that nice and stuffed in there. So you can see it up close. Look how beautiful that is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And I'm gonna put a little bit of spinach on there because you know I just have to be extra. Take some spinach and put that on there. Okay, this is a full wrap, y'all. So let's see how it works. You know, I just pull and grab. If you've seen me roll a wrap before, I just pull, grab sides, pull, keep on pulling until it is secure. Now it's gonna pop open. You already know. Um, but listen, this is my wrap. It's going to be nice and full, and that's just the way I like it. So there it is. We're going to sit it right on the plate. Or a hot pan. Any tomatoes that got lost, <laughs> they're going to eat. Get my hands a little rinse. Guys, look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Isn't that gorgeous? Nice, nice, nice. Now we got a couple more veggies in there, but that's okay. okay. Get some tongs so I can flip it when it's time. I'm gonna stick a couple of toothpicks in there just to hold it. So you just remember, when you're crunched for time for lunch, you can just take your leftovers real quick, put those suckers together, and make you a nice lunch. All right, so it's toasting on that side. This is going to be really good. When I flip it over, I'm going to stick it with these two picks. I'm going to add one in here. One in here now. Just for some extra security. Because I'm definitely going to need it when I flip it. So we're going to take it a roll. Right there, pin it right there. Just to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. Let me go ahead, and I don't wanna cook my avocado. Let me go ahead and take that off of there. <laughs> Look at that, y'all, nice and toasty. There's a nice onion, I'm gonna tuck that back in there. Mm -mm -mm. Isn't that look delicious? Oh my God, it looks so delicious. Mm-hmm. This is what we do with leftovers. Hey, you can always do these leftovers and just treat them good. They treat you good. They're good anyway, because you made it. We're gonna give this a little turn here. I want all my sides charred. See how it's charred on the bottom here? I wanna go ahead and get the sides too. 
I apologize. My little ring going off. <laughs> I think our trash man is out there. All right, we're gonna do this side too. Oh, don't think I don't see your little tomato. I'm gonna get you. Don't you worry. All right, we're gonna let that cook some more. Mm-mm. Just know behind the scenes here, the avocado and tomato are getting eaten. Look at that. And in case you're wondering what oil that is, it's just a little drop of grapeseed oil I like to put on there. Just so I can get a little crunch on there. All right, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and take this off. you see it we're gonna go ahead and cut this and I gotta remember there are other toothpicks in here and we do not want to eat those okay grab me a knife look how beautiful that is y'all alright you already know here comes that crunch mmm If it falls, that's okay, but this is what you want to see right here. Mm -hmm. And beautiful. Look at that butter in that squash. So delicious. So delicious. So, you know, I'm just going to put this together so you can see it. Look at that, both sides. Yum. Who wouldn't want to eat that for lunch? <laughs> Super delicious. Just like that. All right, these are leftovers, y'all. I got to get back to work because, like I said, we are super busy today coming back off the holiday. But I just wanted you to see. I know you don't see me, but I wanted you to see my beautiful lunch today. This is beautiful barbecue jerk butternut squash. Like I said, I'll be posting my dinner recipe from Sunday. Um, and the jerk seasoning that you saw me use, you just have to taper it back a little bit because I did make it a little spicy. But on this cool, breezy wrap, is perfect, okay? All right, have a good day.